What's up, YouTube Business Filipich here, and today we're gonna check out something called a plugin for DAW called the Glue, which is I just bought it a few days ago. So I studied a bit on internet and let's see what this actually can do. So this is tutorial under five minutes, that's gonna be a bit shorter than tutorial. So that's the glue. I have licensed it, you see my name, I didn't pirate it. Okay, anyway, so this have actually one button here, those are presets. So we have for drums, kicks, snares, toms. And we go forward to keys, um, pianos and stuff like that. Or you can save the preset, I'm gonna just pre-save. You put where you're gonna save it, and then you have a preset. Now let's open up and see how this actually works. So it's so simple. Um, it have a makeup, which is most important. So we're gonna just listen to music. Simple. Now the most important is the makeup. So let's boost the makeup. Now when we have makeup here, we use the threshold to see it's minus 20, minus 40. So let's move it like that. Now let's listen with glue and without glue. Yeah, guys, that's possibly the entire point of plugin to boost the makeup. And the reason why we use this one, if it's a zero, you see this, um, it's too powerful. So we're gonna do minus 20, even more. And now it's below zero. And we have even the attack. See, each time you click, it's being an attack, then you have a ratio and the release is after the attack. Anyway, then you have comp in, pickle in, dry wet, dry with without effect. In the side chain. But that's a tire glue, so what you should do. It even has the B part, just in case you didn't notice, you can switch between B and rap. And that's actually render um, recommended for the rendering. So what you should do, increase makeup, put full range, and then just boost the threshold so it's not um, above zero. So yeah, guys, um, that's how to use glue. My name is Silpich, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.